and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. If you're new here, my name is Ben and I'm an actuarial student with the Institute and Faculty of Actuaries. I'm also an actuarial analyst working in South Africa in the general insurance reserving space. In this video, I'm actually throwing it back to something that I filmed last year in 2021 and then I deleted from my phone the day after I filmed it and then went back into my recycle bin and restored it the day after that because I then realized that it's important to keep these moments and document the feelings that you felt in those moments because um, in truth the actuarial journey is not simple it, it is not simple for me it's never been simple for me it's been quite a struggle and it's likely that it will continue to be a struggle going down the road so i'm sure by now you'd have guessed what it is i'm talking about it's actually my results reaction video for the april 2021 exams i've actually gone back and watched it just now and it's really quite emotional quite raw it's just all the feels that you'll get every time you fail an actuarial exam today is results day it's a minute to seven and i'm about to check my results so um i just thought i'd take you guys along again so that i share my reaction to my results like i did last time so yeah um now is the time i'm gonna start oh i need to log in first um As I log in, <clears throat> it's actually seven now. And um, I don't know if the website is, is going to work because normally it crashes and it just goes on a very long holiday. Yeah, it's just loading. <laughs> I probably should have opened it earlier, like I did last time, because right now it's just not working. Yeah, it keeps crashing. I'm going to give it some time. I'll turn you guys back on once I'm able to just log in, because <laughs> there's no point in me keeping the camera on when, you know, nothing's happening. I'm finally in my account. And... Uh, now I just need to go to the exams page. It's opening quite slowly, but at least it's working now. My heart is beating so fast. Okay, that, that worked as well. So I'm going to go to the individual exam result letters so that I just view them one at a time. There you are. Gosh, ah, it crashed again. But it actually hasn't crashed technically. It's just very slow to open the exam result letters tab. Ah, it just opened. So I have just one letter. I'm not sure if both of them are going to be in the same letter. I just want to click this. Oh, no, this is the same as just seeing the list. Okay, that was quick to download. Oh, okay, okay. Now I just have to open it. I failed both subjects. 53 in general insurance and 52 in CP1. Wow. Yeah. This is disappointing. It's very, very disappointing. 
I'm really disappointed in myself. I don't know, I feel like I need a break from like this whole exams thing. Because it hasn't been working out. Maybe I'm just not cut out to be an actuary. It makes you start to think like quite deeply and reflectively about like the meaning of life and the meaning of a whole lot of things. But um just have to accept it. Yeah, it's a huge blow. Congratulations to everyone who passed. And um, sorry to everyone who didn't make it like me. Um, these things happen. And with actuarial exams, it's just like, from now you have to wait another six months before the next set of results. I don't know, hey? Eh? Anyway. It's okay. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed watching that or you found it useful or you, I don't know, cried when I cried. But um, I've just put it out there. That is my journey. That is what has happened and what has been happening. And that's what I felt when I failed in April of last year. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.